intended the council to inform the police and the charity commission that it was aware of these serious allegations. Um, I'm not in a position to answer that question now. I don't have the detail. Um, I understand that the previous manager of the <coughs> Alive became aware of the possibility of this. She was advised to contact the police and she did. A second, yeah, a second question. Can the leader of the council confirm how many full-time equivalent council employees, including the total number of volunteers who have been recruited, will work at our own museum now that it is under local authority control? Can we now? Currently staffing is 0.8 full-time equivalents. Um, it's not possible to confirm how many full-time equivalents, including the total number of volunteers, will work at Harlow Museum in the future. At the present time, no additional council-employed staff have been recruited on a permanent basis. This is because at the present time, the council is assessing the requirements to ensure the long-term sustainability of the museum. When this work is concluded, it will be possible to give an indication of the staffing requirements for the future. There are currently six volunteers assisting at Harlow Museum. This number has not changed since the museum has returned to local authority control. Thank you, I do have a supplementary. Um, can the Leader of the Council confirm the Council's capital works budget for Harley Museum? And will he confirm that the Council will replace the museum roof, which is in urgent need of replacement in this or the next financial year, if it is to remain open? I can confirm that the Harley Museum will remain open and I'll get back to you on the details. Charge. Uh, thank you, Mr. Chairman. Can the leader of the council confirm that the museum opening hours in place before Christmas 2018 will be retained and not reduced while it is under local authority control? I'll take the answer as read. Thank you. Um, I'd like to read the answer if I may. For ask, asking the question, I'd like to read the answer. The museum is currently open to the public two days per week, and there are no plans to reduce this. In fact, it's likely this will be increased over the coming months, dependent on demand, particularly the spring and summer approach. The indications are that the opening of the museum might have been sporadic before Christmas 2018. The council is committed to ensuring that the museum is open on, regular, on a regular basis and that open days are advertised days to ensure that visitors are not disappointed. Chair, I do have a supplementary. Mr. Chairman, um, can the Leader of the Council confirm why in his statement on the future of Harlow Museum dated the 14th of January, he failed to show any acknowledgement or compassion for the staff made redundant, or even the museum manager, Sharon Davis, who has been praised by the Chair of this Council because of his administration's decision to move the service back in-house? Um. This administration's decision to move it back in-house arose because Science Alive, an organisation set up, I think, by Councillor Charles himself, failed to be able to um, continue the support of the museum in a sustainable way. 